right, so as we already know, one of the greatest games of all time is coming to PC in less than 10 days. Which means, naturally, the two biggest questions are, one, how is it going to run on the Steam Deck? And two, what mods are we going to be seeing? Because we know the mods are going to go crazy, okay? We know the mods are going to go crazy. So I thought I'll take this time out to talk about the five mods that I want to see the most for this game. And I'm sure there's plenty more mods that'll be really interesting to see, but I just wanted to keep it short and sweet. So we're going to get into all of that right now. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please make sure to subscribe we are trying to get 10,000 subscribers. I cover a variety of different games and I will be covering Spider-Man PC mods when they come out because I mean, naturally, come on, we have to, right? So we're gonna start this one off with number five and that is using Peter Parker with Spider-Man's abilities. So usually you play a Spider-Man with a suit on and you get the abilities, you're in Peter Parker mode, you can't use the abilities, you're basically human, right? But with this mod, you'd be able to just use Peter Parker the beta and swing around and web shoot and do combat and all sorts of cool shit like that, which apparently was a glitch in the PS4 version of the game that allowed you to do that and I think someone even did make a mod of this on PS4 so I guess something like that for PC would be really cool to see to be able to just swing around move around freely and still be Peter Parker I think that's something crazy that I'd love to see number four stage modifications stage mods would be crazy I don't know how viable this is but I'm gonna mention it anyway because the ability to just take other environments from I don't know other games and just place it into Spider-Man's world and swing around it I think that could be insane Saying. like imagine being able to take like i don't know florence from like assassin's creed 2 and just start swinging around the buildings and shit or roma from assassin's creed brotherhood like the amount <laughs> how crazy would that be to swing around renaissance italy as spider-man or etsy Ooh, as it, or imagine just swinging around as etsy that'd be crazy but environments from other games being modded into here if they could pull that shit off those are going to be some really entertaining stage mods like you could make a whole separate like game mode of just playing in different environments with the same it could be the same kind of combat and shit but just in those environments and it would go really crazy i would love to see that number three toby Maguire. now we already have toby's suit in the game so i mean that's pretty cool so i guess all you'd have to do is add in his voice clips and of course his face for the peter parker sections i don't know if that's possible if they could just take it from somewhere i don't know if they could even model that to be doable i'm sure it's technically possible but whether it would be easy enough for a mod to do i don't know but i would love to see toby in there i don't know how far the mod would go like would they switch mj's face as well to be kirsten dunst i don't i don't know speaking of which my Miles Morales is in this game as well. Maybe they could make him another character from the MCU or something. I don't know. Make him Tom Holland. <laughs> then you can see Toby and Tom in those scenes together with Peter Parker and Miles Morales. I don't know. There's so many possibilities here. Now, number two is one that I don't think a lot of people are talking about. Maybe it doesn't really concern a lot of people. But for me, I think it was important. I think fall damage should be a mod, right? In this game, when you swing around, there's no real risk of anything. Because if you messed up swinging and you fell to the ground, you wouldn't lose any real significant damage i don't think you lose any damage it's been a while since i played but you wouldn't die basically i get that spider-man is powerful or whatnot but you could literally jump from the tallest building in the city and just jump straight to the ground and it's just like nothing happened right i mean you you plop on the ground for a bit but it's not it's nothing significant right so i feel like fall damage creates that risk reward system where you're swinging and you have to be good at swinging so that you don't fall and take damage or fall and die i don't know if it should be instant death i don't think that makes sense i mean i guess it depends on the height of which you fall the higher you fall the more damage you take if you don't have enough health then that would be death but some form of actual risk for swinging would make it way more thrilling right i mean there's no real reward without risk i can't even say that sentence there's no real reward <sighs> And number one, I mean, this should come as no surprise to any of you. The original Peter Parker face on the PS4 version. As we know, it was a controversial decision when they switched the face for a whole new face in Spider-Man Remastered for the PS5. It was literally the only con of the PS5 version compared to the PS4 version. Now, some people prefer the Home Holland version of the face, and that's cool. I mean, you've got that. But now that it's come to PC, it would be nice to see that original face make a comeback. I don't care if the animations aren't as accurate as the PS5 version. I just want to see the original face because I think it just fit better with the story and i mean changing the face of a character is a big deal right you connected the character we play the ps4 version first and to just change the face was a bit of an annoying decision by insomniac and whether their reasons were justified or not i don't know i'm not a game developer but it would be nice to see that original face make a comeback and quite frankly that's how i'm going to be in the game like once that mod drops that's when i'm beating the game before that i'm just going to play around a bit i mean i guess i can't carry over my save files so i'll probably have to beat the game straight when it comes out and then once we get an original face mod then i guess i can do new game plus with the original face mod that makes sense but yeah these are just the five mods i wanted to see the most there's plenty of other things that'll be nice to see like i guess tom holland andrew garfield you know fucking gwen stacy is the main character i don't know like there's plenty of mods that could go in this game i'm definitely going to be keeping a close eye on the modding scene for the game and hopefully 
hopefully some things will pique my interest that I didn't even think of and we'll be able to try them out on the channel. But yeah, let me know what kind of mods you want to see in the game. Do you agree with my list? Is there anything you would add or take away? But yeah, make sure to like, comment, subscribe, hit that bell. More content coming soon to the channel. But it is your boy, Ram Remulus Rem Gang. And I'm out.